What's going on YouTube? It's Mike here. Today guys are going to be talking about iOS 6 and its final release. So yes guys, today is the day for all of you long awaiting iOS 5 uh, runners that are pretty much uh, we're not able to update to the beta or just didn't get a chance to update to the GM. iOS 6 is now out and available for free from Apple for download. This is the public release. Uh, there is no betas. Everything is done in testing. It's September 19th, 2012, and Apple's finally letting everyone use it. Um, so pretty much all you have to do is, uh, if you are running on iOS 5, this excludes the iPad 1, uh, since the iPad 1 has uh, officially just been cut off by Apple, and they're no longer supporting it. Every other device though that's on iOS 5 will work. Anyways, just go off to Settings, and then I'll just start this over from here. You're going to go to General, Software Update, and you will get a notification saying iOS 6 from Apple Inc., and then it'll tell you some, like, uh, over 250 new features or something like that, and it'll tell you bug fixes and stuff, and then it'll say Download and Install. First thing you're going to need is a Wi-Fi network. You can't download this over 3G or 4G because otherwise uh, you'd be getting a mean bill from uh, your carrier uh, because it does take up a lot of internet since it is a firmware update. It's several hundred megabytes. Um, so you are going to need to connect to Wi-Fi. Apple also recommends that you connect to a power source. Personally, I never do. Uh, they just recommend it. You don't have to. Just hit OK and then you'll be able to download it. They say that because it does take up a lot of battery. Well, it does take up a lot of internet usage, but that's why Apple uh, restricts it to only Wi-Fi to avoid those uh, big phone bills. Now, I've already done this. That's why you see my iOS 6, your software is up-to-date screen, so I'm pretty much done from there. And then, that's it. You're on iOS 6, your phone will reboot and stuff, and then you'll be greeted with the new home screen. And then you guys can pretty much go from there. You now have iOS 6. Of course, if you still want to, you can still update with your computer. Uh, by just plugging your iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch in. And, of course, you know, if it's running the eligible version of iOS 5, to update to iOS 6, and then you could pretty much just go from there. So, thank you guys for watching this video. Before I get out of here, I just want to remind you with one thing. If you want to see my iOS 6 full review, pretty much just top 10 features that I chose uh, a few months ago when the first beta came out, definitely be sure to check that out. There is a link in the description. Also, I want to make another notation. You will notice that the YouTube app is now off your home screen. Uh, Apple no longer supports the YouTube app. It's not hidden in a folder or anything. It's just off. Now, if you're wondering what this new YouTube icon is over here, it's Google has developed their own app. And I'll explain all this now. Pretty much, uh, Google Google's contract with Apple ended. I did a full coverage video on this already. I'm not going to go nuts with details, but uh, Google and Apple ended their contract. And um, so Google still has their permission to release whatever app they want from the App Store, and they did so. Um, so it no longer comes preloaded on the iOS, but you could just go download from the App Store free. And personally, I think it's so much better than what we had on iOS. Uh, it runs so much faster. You can watch music videos from Vivo and stuff that they wouldn't normally allow. Uh, any movie now or video can play on the iPhone, even or iPod Touch or iPad, even if it's uh, mobile device restricted. That's how it works for me at least. Um, so definitely go check it out and download it for free. And then you also notice there is a new Maps icon because, like I said, Google and Apple's contract ended. So Apple pretty much destroyed the whole Maps app and redid it themselves. And I think it is pretty good. By destroyed, I just mean they started fresh. All right, guys, be sure to comment below. Of course, rate, give this video a thumbs up, and click the subscribe button up top. Stay tuned for my iPhone 5 unboxing, guys. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace. What's going on YouTube? It's Mike Cronin from Mike's I Caught Up 101. You are plus I was everything unboxings, reviews, how to's, news, giveaways, and more. Be sure to comment, rate, and subscribe, and check out the last updated video. Updated video. Updated video. Updated video. Updated video. What's going on YouTube? It's Mike Cronin from Mike's I Caught Up 101. You are plus I was everything unboxings, reviews, how to's, news, giveaways, and giveaways, and giveaways, and more.